Hello everyone, uh, this trick is by Charlie Hudson, it's called Feral Location. This really is a fantastic card location. Now without a spectator, it's not going to go for too well on video here, because uh, I'm going to have to select the card and all that stuff, but it, I want to put it on my channel because it is a very uh, excellent, excellent card location. So here's, you can borrow the deck, it's impromptu, you deck a mix here, no, first let me show the deck, okay, and it can be shuffled by spectator as many times as I want. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you what I want you to do in a second, okay? I want you to cut off, cut off about 10 or so cards. So the spectator cuts off about that many cards. So I'm going to cut off about 10 myself. And I'm going to, in a second, I'm going to have you look through your packet and think of any card you can see, okay? So, for example, if you're looking at this packet, let's say you thought of the Jack of Spades. And it's, I want you to also think of the card, but also how many down from the top of the packet it is. So, the Jack of Spades... It's fourth, one, two, three, fourth in the top, okay? One, two, three, four. So there you remember four in the jack of spades, okay? Now they're going to do that with their packet, okay? They're going to look at the cards. Now I'm going to have to see it. Your back is going to be turned right now. You don't see any of this, okay? You don't know how many cards they cut off. You don't, you don't even know the cards they're, gonna, they're looking at right now, okay? Now to make it easy, let's, I'll make it, let's, to make it easy, let's say you think of, Let's say the fifth card of two hearts. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. Okay, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. And the two hearts. Okay, so they're remembering five and the two hearts. Place the packet on the table. You drop the deck on top. And now give the deck a few cuts. Spectator does this. Now remember, your back was turned during the whole procedure. And you're thinking five and the two hearts. They hand you the deck and say, now, I'm going to give it a good mix here. In fact, I need my glasses here for this part. Hopefully, you don't need your glasses. But I'm going to cut the deck about half, just like this. And I'm going to shuffle one half right into the other half, very fairly. In fact, you can see the cards getting mixed, okay? Now, here's what I want you to do to help me out a little bit here. Look through the cards and find your card and put it... The exact number from the top that you're thinking of. So they're going to go through the deck and they're going to look for the two of hearts and bring it fifth from the top. So we're going to do that is once they find the two of hearts, okay, there's two hearts right there. So they're going to cut it so it's two, four, fifth from the top and give it a cut. Okay, so two of hearts is fifth from the top. Now your back is turned during that procedure right here. You didn't see any of that. Okay, when they, when they take the deck back, you don't see any of it, okay? Now, what you're going to do here is that now I'm going to find your card. We're going to find your card. I'm going to guess, I'm going to find how many cards from the top it also was, okay? So, here we go. I think I got it, okay? Here, here's what I'm going to do. Fan the deck, spread the deck. And there's one card face up. That card tells me your card was fifth in the top. Am I correct? I am. Okay. Look, I'm going to split the deck right there. And we're going to count down five cards. Okay? One, two, three, four. And what was the card that you looked at? Two hearts. And there it is, the two hearts. Now, like I said, without a spec there, it doesn't go over that well. But remember, your back was turned during the procedure where they think of a card and how many down from the top it is, and the second part of the trick, your back is turned again when they place the card back in the original position. It's a really great card location. Hope you enjoyed it by Charlie Hudson. Thank you.